Okay, welcome back, John. Do you want to tell us a little bit about this garden? How you managed to uh, gain this contract and uh, transform it? Well, this garden's actually in High Newton in the South Lakes. It's a totally different landscape to the ones that uh, you've seen so far. This house is actually an 18th century house. So um, what we wanted to do was to um, reflect that fact in the planting. So you will see that there are very few actual shrubs in this garden. There are a few additions that have gone in since the landscape was done. But in the main you will see that it's herbaceous perennials, which is absolutely typical of um, a garden of this period. The garden next door was also laid out by us, which you'll be able to see in a moment. That's actually on a house a hundred years older and you will actually be able to see the difference in the type of landscape there also. So obviously during the winter period then all this would just be sparse. Yes, that's the one downside of uh, this type of landscape. This garden's actually had a, a lot of structural alterations. The, um, there's a wall down to our left here now, which actually used to run right across the garden. And because it's a listed building, we were given strict instructions that if it was moved, it had to look like it had never been done. So it was painstakingly dismantled. Even all the ferns were potted up and then put back into the wall as we rebuilt. The garden down to your right now is actually the uh, garden to the original old house. Um, and you can see the style of planting again is completely different. Um, this, this house was actually built in the late 1500s, so there's a hundred years difference between the two landscapes. There's a few modern additions that the present owners actually put in, but basically it's as it's been done. 